So number one, the immunological unresponsiveness denotes immunodeficiency, inflammation, tolerance, autoimmunity. So great answer is option C. Immunological unresponsiveness to any substance is known as immunological tolerance. Question number two. The immune system confers long-lasting protection by specificity, diversity, memory, recognition. So correct answer is option C. Immune system have memory cells that provide long-lasting protection against different antigens. Question number three. The substance that binds to an antibody is known as antigen, paratope, CDRS, or peptide. So, correct answer is option A. Antigen is a substance that can bind to an antibody. So, number four, the second line of defense are innate mechanism, adaptive mechanism, humoral mechanism, cell mediated mechanism. So, correct answer is option B. Adaptive mechanism represents the second line of defense. Question number five. The condition where immune system reacts to the self antigen is known as tolerance, innate immunity, autoimmunity, immunodeficiency. So correct answer is option C. When immune system reacts to the self antigen, it is known as autoimmunity. Question number six. The selective theory of antibody production was proposed by Paul Ehrlich, Fischer, Jules Bardet, Metzinkoff. So correct answer is option A. The selective theory of antibody production was proposed by Paul Ehrlich. According to this theory, it is not the antigen but the antibody molecule that plays central role in determining its specificity. Question number seven. The maternal IgG immunoglobulin transfers to the fetus represents the passive immunity, acquired immunity, innate immunity or active immunity. So correct answer is option A. The transfer of maternal IgG to the fetus is example of passive immunity. Question number 8. The low stomach pH represents the anatomic barrier, physiological barrier or phagocytic barrier, inflammatory barrier. So correct answer is option B. The low pH of stomach represents the physiological barrier. Question number 9. The cellular immune response are mediated by B cells, T cells, epithelial cells, both B and T cells. So correct answer is option B. The cellular immune response are mediated by T cell. Next question ki taraf jane se pehle meri aap se darkhast hai ki agar aapne bhi tegas channel ko subscribe nahi kiya to please subscribe kar lein. Question number 10. An enzyme with broad spectrum antibacterial effect is pepsin, papain, renin. Lysozyme. So correct answer is option D. Lysozyme is an enzyme with broad spectrum antibacterial effect. Question number 11. Which is predominant immunoglobulin in our body? IgA, IgG, IgM, IgE. So correct answer is option C. IgM is the predominant immunoglobulin in the body. Question number 12. The opsonization helps in cleaving the antigen, phagocytosis, lysis, clearance to the spleen. So, the answer is option B. Opsonization, which is the identification of antigen by specific components, opsonin, it helps in phagocytosis. Question number 13. Which of the following is not a phagocyte? Macrophags, monocytes, lymphoblast. Neutrophils. So, correct answer is option C. Lymphoblast is a naive lymphocyte. It is not a phagocyte. Question number 14. The movement of phagocytes from the capillaries into the tissues is known as margination, exudation, chemotaxics, diapadesis. So, correct answer is option D. The movement of phagocytes from the capillaries into the tissue is known as diapadesis. Question number 15. The macrophags localized in the liver are called histiocytes, mesangial cells, Kupfer cells, osteoclasts. So, correct answer is option C. Kupfer cells are the macrophags that are localized in the liver. Question number 16. An example of antigen presenting cells is T lymphocytes, erythrocytes, dendritic cell, 
stromal cell so correct answer is option c dendritic cell is an example of antigen presenting cell next question ki taraf jane se pehle again meri aap se darkhwast hai ki agar aapne bhi tak channel ko subscribe nahi kiya to please subscribe kar le question number 17 nerve and mammary b cells can be distinguished by morphology cytoplasmic content surface marker or site of occurrence so correct answer is option c the nerve and mammary b cells can be distinguished by presence of different surface marker nerve cells are those which uh, have not encountered any antigen question number 18 the chief antigen presenting cells are lymphocytes phagocytes erythroblasts lymphoblasts so correct answer is option b phagocytes are the chief antigen presenting cells number 19 macrophages that are localized in the lungs are histiocytes mesangial cells kuffer cells osteoclast so no option is correct because the macrophages that are located in the lungs they are known as alveolar macrophages question number 20 the primary cells that interlink innate and adaptive immune system are macrophages platelets t cells natural killer cells so correct answer is option a macrophages are the primary cells that can interlink the innate and adaptive immune system with each other